having said all of that, we have a big pile of books. This is Saturday's Saturday's learning special. Um, Strengths Finder 2.0. All right, this is kind of like a catalog of strengths. Tom Tom Rath is that you can see that Tom Rath Strengths Finder 2.0. And what's unique and interesting about this book is at the back you have this little thingy here, and this thingy contains um, an access code to the Strengths Finder 2.0 website where you can take a number of Strengths Finder tests. And in this thing, you will be given um, a, a very nice long menu of personality and uh, capacity attributes there. So this goes on and on and on. Developer, discipline, empathy, focus, futuristic, harmony, ideation, includer, individuation, input, intellectual, learner, maximizer. Um, like I said, there, Tom Rath, Tom Rath, Strengths Finder 2.0. Um, get, get with that. And especially if you're about to deliver a training, you know, are you going to go out there and sort of put your, expand your bubble of being out there and impact other lives and have, um, input into how other people's thought processes will work? Well, what I would suggest is get, get, start tracking, start tracking your, your capacities, where you are, are strong and where you need to work on. Because people are just not getting this, I think. I, I see just too many trainers, far too many trainers and sub-trainers, trainer assistants and things like that, that have very low awareness of their area of effectiveness and their areas of ineffectiveness and how they need to work on their style and they're kind of stuck in a stuck sort of in a on, on a little stylistic I don't know sort of a stylistic rut or wheel and they need to get past that they need to get to to a, a broader more effective way of doing their work I like this book a lot too uh, Robert I Sutton weird ideas that work I think this was this was really good and I learned a lot from that that is a extremely useful book, Weird Ideas That Work. We'll show it on this side, too, by Robert Sutton. Ha! Ah, believe it or not, there is. There is an entire book specific to the vestibular system. Okay? Here it is. Balance in Search of a Lost Sense by Scott McCready. Balance in Search of a Lost Sense. This is another book in our Master Practitioner Training. This was distributed to every member of our prac track to introduce the idea of the vestibular system as a distinct sensory modality. Balance in search of a lost sense. This, this is mandatory. Everybody in NLP or is claiming to do NLP or has anything to say about NLP is not, is not current. You are not current unless you've read this book and you understand what it has to say. Um, Chip and Dan Heath, maybe it's Heath, made to stick why some ideas survive and others die so uh, I guess today is drill down into specifics day these are books you have, you must read made to stick by Chip and Dan Heath Heth. simple unexpected concrete credible emotional stories so if you're going to do good NLP, which means if you're going to be a good communicator, you're going to be a highly effective communicator and your stuff is going to get over and people are going to buy in or track what you're talking about, made to stick. Our last book here, Blind Spots by Madeline L. Von Hecke, Ph.D., Blind Spots. Also, this book was distributed at the Master Practitioner Training, okay? Everybody got a copy of Blind Spots. This has a lot to do with feedback loops and how to make them, how to make them work. How do you get yourself some feedback loops? How do you tighten up your feedback loops? How do you figure out where you truly and royally suck and need to stop sucking? <laughs> why, do, why do I suck so much? Maybe I should get this book. Okay, stop sucking. Get this book because there, 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 there's just there's just too much suckiness around. There really is, and it's painful. It's awesomely painful. It's kind of like getting a chili pepper enema or something to sit through some of these presentations. So, um, all right, buy them, read them, master them, become them, get with it.